let me start this video by saying Kong is not dead. I said I was not going to make a video about this because it was kind of annoying me yesterday, and it still is annoying. We saw a very short clip yesterday of Mason Weaver and Captain Conrad in front of Kong saying that he was just defending his territory, and in the background we saw Kong on his back, not breathing. Now, a lot of people were outraged by this, and I was as well. To show this in a TV spot, especially when it's five days away from the actual movie, it's a big leap. So, this is why I don't think that Kong is dead in this situation, and this is what I think will happen after this scene. So, I just want to start this by saying I did predict this almost two months ago in one of the ways that Kong Skull Island would end, but I also did not say that this would happen in the middle of the film, which I'm assuming it does. My old prediction was Kong would be on the ground, a bunch of smoke is around him, the smoke clears up, Mason Weaver and Captain Conrad are standing there in front of Kong to protect him. If you want to watch the video, I will be linking it in the description below, so check it out. So let's look at this from a movie standpoint. Showing Kong's death in a TV spot would make no sense. And we already know right now that Kong has been dropped many times during this film. We have seen Kong get injured so many times from the propellers, from bullets, and even from the skull crawlers. At one point, one of the skull crawlers had Kong on his back and someone shot the skull crawlers, taking them away from Kong. So this is nothing new basically, but the thing is, Kong was never fully passed out or knocked out. This is the first time we've seen Kong look dead in this film. But now let's talk about what will happen after this scene. So I'm assuming that Captain Conrad and Mason Weaver are talking to the military at this point. And if you notice, this scene happens at night, right? So what else happens at night? This is when we see Lieutenant Packard go face to face with one of the biggest skull crawlers on Skull Island. Now, is this the scene where a skull crawler comes out of the water and then they have to wake up Kong maybe to go and fight it? Or is this the point in the film where the military realizes who the real enemy is, either themselves or the skull crawlers? So maybe the military unleashes on the skull crawler, the giant one of course. But this cannot be the end for Kong. There is just no way. Maybe I just cannot accept it, but I'm pretty sure this is not the end for Kong. Kong will rise again and either go after the military or the skull crawlers, one of the two. But we are almost certain at this point that Kong will not die in this film. He will be going through a lot of tough things, but definitely not death. But leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Do you actually think Kong is dead in this clip? And do you think my two theories on what could happen after this scene are accurate or just correct in general? And what do you guys think will happen after Kong is passed out? Do you think he will rise again and go after the military or he will go after the skull crawlers? Leave this all in the comment section below. And if you guys are new to the channel, please subscribe, and as always guys, leave a like, and have a nice day.